Welcome to Moo Moo Math. What I'd like to accomplish in this uh, video today is to show you visually by filling these, uh, this triangular pyramid and this triangular prism up with water and showing you how the triangular excuse me, the triangular pyramid is one third the volume of the triangular prism. The formula for finding the volume of a triangle prism is your base area times the height of the prism. And since this is a triangular prism, it would be one half base times height, then times the height of the prism itself. And when I measured these, I measured the base was five centimeters, and the height measuring from here to here was four centimeters, and then the actual height from here to here, I got my ruler out, measured this in centimeters, was also five. And when you multiply all this out, one half times 20 is 10, 10 times five, it would be 20 centimeters cubed. Therefore, if the formula for the triangular pyramid, you can see it has an apex here, would be basically one third, and it's one third times the base area of the pyramid times its height. So this works out to be one third times one half the base of the pyramid times the height of this triangle base times the height of the pyramid. And you can tell by setting them beside each other that they're the same height. So therefore, it would be one third times one half five times four times five and when you multiply all this out it should be one third of fifty and it is it's sixteen point six 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 seven repeating so that's mathematically now what I would like to do is take just a second and let's visually fill them up with water and see if it works. Okay, so now let's visually see how that. As you can tell, the triangular pyramid, and it's triangular because the base has a triangular shape, the triangular pyramid is equal to the, is the same base as the triangular prism, and it's also the same height. You can see it's the same height, my finger's right there, same height. So, in theory, the volume of this triangular pyramid should be exactly one-third the volume of this prism. And we'll prove this by pouring water into the pyramid. Here is one. I'll get it up to the very top. There is one. Okay, and here goes two. Missed a little bit there. And number three, it should be at the very, very tippy top. I did miss a little bit there. Anyway, you can see it's at the very, very top. So you can see that it's perfectly exact amount. Three of these equal one of those, just like the formula says it should. Hope this was helpful. Please subscribe to Moo Moo Math. We upload a new math video or geometry video every day. Hope this helps.